Hey guys, uh, good morning. So today I decided I wanted to do a um, day in the life of me on Weight Watchers Blue and 75 Hard. Um, thought that'd be a cool video for you guys. Um, I already took my pre-workout, so I'm sorry that's not videotaped or recorded. Why am I saying videotape? Anyways, it's been a long day. I'm super tired already, and I've only been awake for like an hour and a half. Um, but I just took my pre-workout so that I can start my workout, and then after I work out, I have to get ready and go to work. Um, I got my water here. Because I have to drink a gallon of water. I have already drank a half a gallon. Um, just within the last hour. I woke up uh, super thirsty this morning for some reason. So, And then once I get to work, I usually read my 10 pages at work. So you guys will see me do that. My second workout will come later. And I have a Mother's Day dinner later. Um, so yeah, you guys are just going to see like a life uh, day in the life of me on... Weight Watchers Blue and 75 Hard, and you guys will get to see, like, sort of what I eat every day, um, and stuff like that. So, today's gonna be a little bit different, obviously, because I have that Mother's Day dinner, um, and I don't know what they're having, so I'm gonna have to either dip into my weekly points for Weight Watchers, or I'm going to have to try to save as many points throughout the day so that I have a little cushion for my daily points, so... I haven't decided how I'm going to do that yet, but as you guys can see, I'm on day 14 of 75 hard, and you can see, like, my skin looks great. I am losing this right here um, from the water drinking and just feeling good. Unfortunately, this last week, for some reason, on Weight Watchers Blue, I have gained three pounds. I'm not quite sure what is going on, because I feel like I have been... Um, really hardcore going at it and really making sure I don't go over my dailies but um but yeah I know I know that things happen and I just work harder this week to get it done so next you guys are gonna see a little spinny around thing uh doing my um progress picks for 75 hearts so stay tuned for the rest of the video if you guys like these kind of videos, please take a moment to like and subscribe, as well as comment below and let me know that you like them, because I do like doing them. They are a little bit more work than usual, but I definitely like doing them because I like watching them, so I figure if I like watching them, people like other people like watching them too, so. But yeah, definitely like and subscribe, let me know what you think, um, and again, I'm not a professional, so like, I'm sorry, it may look choppy, it may, uh look like I'm shaking or whatever but yeah so I hope you enjoy Alrighty, so as you guys know, or if you don't know, definitely check it out the link below about 75 hard, but you have to do two 45-minute workouts, one inside, or one of them has to be outside, so I always start with my inside workout, and then after work, or during work, I walk for 45 minutes, so I always still do dance fitness with Jessica, that is still one of my favorite, the Saturday is live right now, so I'm definitely going to do that one. I'm a little late to the live, um, but I would just wait till the next song and I will jump in and go with the live for 45 minutes. So that's what I do. And then, yeah, so you guys will see me do that. Get it. 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 Get it.
all right already so I'm ready to make breakfast and as you can see I always have a helper here he's always right there but um yeah so I'm gonna sit you guys down here okay so after my workout I always just make sure that I turn my Fitbit off I had 45 minute workout um I drank just a little bit more of the water I think it was about here whenever we talked last um so I drank quite a bit of water during the workout I always do and that's the only way that I have not gotten like sore doing it um and then I do the exact same thing every single morning whether I work whether I don't I wake up at six o'clock do my workouts and um everything like that typically I do more than 45 minutes but today um for the sake of me having to actually go to work in about an hour, I do need to just chill it with a 45 minute. Um, so what I do every morning is I make a whey protein. Um, I make a whey protein drink. So as you guys know, if you didn't see my last video, I start my day with this. Um, I'm actually almost out. This is a game changer, I'm telling you. It is a game changer for your workout. So then, after I work out, I make a whey protein. So I use the D2 Fit whey protein as well. So that is what I do. So we're going to go ahead and do that. Sorry for the weird angle. Hopefully that's okay for you guys. So... I always, I do this, but I don't know if I should, but I do it anyways, um, because it doesn't say anywhere that you shouldn't, but instead of using milk, I use a Premier Protein, which is really good on the Weight Watchers, this is only three points, and this will be my breakfast, so you take one scoop of the D2 Fit Whey Protein. Okay, and then I also, thanks to Nikki Gets Fit on um, YouTube, which I will link her below, I do my greens every morning as well. I got the detox and digest, and this is not flavored. She prefers the um, mixed berry, but I couldn't find it, so... But this is one scoop, so I put one scoop in with my shake. That is one full serving of my greens. And then I put a whey, uh, Premier Protein in. Whoop, maybe. And by the way, I got these whey protein, or not whey, excuse me, these Premier Proteins in a box over there of... 18 or 20 for 23 dollars which is like phenomenal in my opinion so we open here all right then i just dump this in here and it's exactly almost exactly what the uh thing calls for because you're supposed to mix the whey protein with um 8 to 12 or 8 to 10 ounces or something like that there we go then you just shake it because this is 11.5 ounces so and you gotta really get in there and shake it so that it gets all of it off the bottom and then I shake it up when I do my breakfast so that's my first part of my breakfast and then I always start before I eat anything, I use the D2 Fit 4-in-1 as well. I take this first. And then I take my vitamins. Which I use the Ollie Women's Multi. They are chewy. Then I use the Ollie Undeniable Beauty. Which again, 
a Russell Chewy. And then I eat three of the Golly apple cider vinegar. While I'm chilling, I'm gonna make my other part of my breakfast. So another thing that I eat almost every morning that I got from Nikki Gets Fit is these Egg Beaters Southwest. They already have onions and peppers in them and they're a little spicy and this is actually going to be the last of it because I measure it out uh, based upon the serving size. Which is, um, I do about a cup, I think, or a half a cup. Yeah, I do a half a cup, which is two large eggs. And you don't need to mix it or anything. You just throw it in the microwave. Alright, I will be back in just a moment. Alright, and then of course before I eat, I have to take my sugar. Um, those were in there from the other day when I was with Julie. Okay, so just check my sugar. My sugar has been really super good um for the last couple week about a week actually um sorry if you hear that noise that's my bunny rabbit trying to tear apart his cage for some reason i do have a new one touch thing um it's extra fine needles so they don't hurt my fingers bad hey demo quit hey Alright, anyway, so we're going to check my sugar. Um, let's do... Okay. See what it is. It is actually pretty high right now. I'm not sure why it could have been from what I ate for dinner last night. Um, but it's all, it all could also be my pre-workout. The pre-workout does make it a little high. It's about 150 right now, which is a lot higher than it has been for a while. So a little disappointed in that, but it should go down today now that I am not eating, um, you know, carby things and once the pre-workout wears off. So yeah, do that. And then I'm just going to eat my, I'm just going to eat my breakfast and go get ready for work all right guys so it is actually lunch time for me i don't actually get a lunch because i'm only here 11 to 4 but i am going to go down here and grab myself something to eat sorry it's going to get really dark really quick um but yeah so i'm going to go down to the dc i'm going to grab something to eat and then uh, I just checked my sugar my sugar was 85 which is super good so here we go probably get a bang as well Let's see what they have they have a fruit cup I could probably eat that fruit cup but it actually looks like the thing is down, so that's not going to work. Well, that was a bummer. But it looks like they're having pizza today. I can't have pizza anyways, so lunch is a bust. <laughs> I guess I will just drink my Premier Protein as my lunch for today. And that'll be that, I guess. So I'm almost done working. It's about two o'clock. So I have two more hours. Um, stay tuned for the rest of the day. Alrighty, so since I am sort of taking a break right now, I have about 15 minutes. I, tap, I get a 15 minute break. Um, 
since I am doing that, I am going to go ahead and read my uh, 10 pages for the day. Um, anytime I read a self-help book, I always put notes um, and highlight things. Um, as you guys can see, I highlight things all the time and I keep notes of things. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go ahead and start doing that and I'm going to just time lapse this video and you guys can watch me read my 10 pages for the day. Alrighty guys, so I just got off work and I am getting ready to do my 45 minute workout. So let me set it here. I'm gonna set my Fitbit. So I have a Fitbit so like I can set it for uh, walking. In that way, 
I know exactly how far I walked, what my pace is, um, 45 minutes, you know, that kind of thing, because I have to do an outside 45 minute workout, so that's what I'm doing right now. Thank goodness that it got nicer outside, because it was a little rainy, and it looks like it was going to stay rainy, so I was like, oh, I hope not. But as you can see, the beautiful sun is out, and it's going to be such a nice walk. So I thought, I guys, I thought I'd bring you guys along with me. Um, so yeah, hope you guys enjoy my walk. So I decided to walk on the Mon River Trail again. And the river is pretty fierce today because it's been raining a lot. So they have a lot of locks open. Actually, they have all of the locks open except for one, which is crazy because they don't normally have that many locks open. But, yeah, so I decided it's so nice, and I love walking it, the trail. Uh, yeah, so I thought I'd try down here before I have to go to this Mother's Day thing, so... Also along the trail here, they have like a little play thing for kids, well exercise thing for kids, and um, for adults, plus they have like a mural thingy, and it's so cool, there's like people for dressing up for prom getting pictures and stuff, so it's kind of cool to see, but um, yeah, so I'm just getting done, what are you up to? This cool thing here. I'm gonna show you what it looks like. Sorry, I was talking to somebody. Walk by. I'm extremely out of breath. <laughs> but yeah, like, look at how pretty 
this is like look how beautiful like let me get you a little closer these are all like glass like it's so pretty And then you walk over here and they have like playthings and like I'm gonna work out a little on the adult one. So yeah, this is a cool addition to the trail. Um, you can like play with your kids, do the obstacle course, you can have a seat or you can work out. They have like an ab machine, they have a shoulder press machine, they have um, a bicycle machine, they have a chest and back press, push up, assisted row, and uh, things like that. So yeah, it's a pretty cool addition. All right, and then they also have these things here that you can make music on. Like, which are kind of cool. That's such a cool sound. But yeah, so there's a lot of like really awesome things that you can do along the trail besides just walk, which is what makes it so fun to walk. But I'm almost done with my workout. I am at 39 minutes, almost two miles, and then, um, the only bad thing is, is I gotta walk back, so, but that's what I'm doing right now. Looking out on the dock for a little bit, I love to sit out here, I, sometimes I bring my journal and sit out here, but I just wanted to get a really good picture of the bridge. Alright. So yeah, that is our bridge. I zoom you guys in, maybe you guys can see it a little bit more. But you can also see the... What's cool is you can also see the school. But yeah, this is one of my favorite places right here. Absolute favorite places. So, but yeah. Now I'm just going to walk back to the car. And then I have to go up to Walmart and buy some flowers. And, um, go to the Mother's Day dinner. Alright guys, so I made it, but I have to do some deodorant. and some body spray because like <clears throat> just because I've been walking and I didn't get a chance to go home and shower so here I am all right oh my gosh that came up in good thing um but yeah so I just had the cards. I have no idea what I did with it. Oh my gosh. I'm losing my mind, guys. Losing my mind. Did I put them in here? Sorry about the weird angle. Alright. I do have... I did get flowers for my stepmom and my grandma. And here's what they look like. They're very pretty. But I'm getting ready to walk into the church. So yeah, I have to find my, um, I have to find my card. Okay. Here's the setup. Hello?
Um, anyway, sorry, that put me at just enough points to be in the blue still. And, um, yeah, so I was able to eat in the blue today. Um, my sugar ended up going back down around lunch. It was 85. And then it did go up a little bit more before dinner at 123, but still pretty good. And overall, I had a really good day. I hope you guys enjoyed. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!